Marquez Hernandez from Team Mexico. Currently, the team in eighth position as their anchor makes his way into the main arena aboard Wound by Juice. Well, Kenny, this is this is a unique situation. Jose is a non-professional rider. He does not train for the public. He has a real job, and uh, he rides his own horses. Um, Jose has had tremendous success, not only with this horse, but many others that he has bred, raised, and done much of the training himself. He is the NRHA Futurity Non-Pro Reserve Champion. So far, off to a very good start. Great start to the turn, great cadence. Uh, every step was quick, solid, and mirrored uh, the previous. A great shutoff, nice and quiet. Jose looking like a real professional. Anybody who uh, ever gets a chance to meet Jose, you'll know he's not afraid. And he's demonstrating that right now. He's a, he's a gentleman with a great deal of enthusiasm and uh, a great love of this sport. And he is laying it all out right now. Demonstrated a really, really nice set of circles there. Uh, tremendous uh, speed and a high degree of difficulty in those fast circles. And you'll notice when he slowed down, he just set his hand down on that horse's neck, relaxed his body, of course, came right back to him. Little bobble there in uh, the lead change. We'll leave that one up for the judges to decide. Here we go with a great, great degree of difficulty. He's really pushing this horse hard. I don't think this horse could run much faster at this point. And I'm not sure the people at home can even get an idea of how fast they are going into that very small corner to make those turns. Well, you know, Kenny, that's a very good point. I often get to watch myself on video, and video slows everything down. So if you're at home watching this right now, I guarantee you that what you see is going a lot faster. It's like the first time if you've ever been with a break seat or field level at an NFL game, and you go, wow, these guys are even bigger and faster in person. So too are these horses making their maneuvers here. Exactly. If you think it's fast, it's strong, it's quick on TV, Kenny, you need to go see it in person. Jose Vasquez Hernandez from Team Mexico, the anchor on their squad, an outside chance of moving up into medal contention. You know, Kenny, medal or no medal, uh, Mexico is probably the fastest affiliate that is growing in the NRHA. Uh, very, very competitive, very intense. Jose's been leading that movement, has been a great example for the country. Great stop. Kenny, I'm not sure he made it past that middle marker. We're going to have to see what the judges have to say. By not going past those middle cones, you can incur a two-point penalty. However, you need to be in the judges' chair right in the center of the arena to make that call. And the appreciative fans for Team Mexico. As we watch Jose Vasquez Hernandez and Wound by Juice once again. And Aaron, you talked about his riding style, certainly a rider who never backs off of anything. You know, Jose, I don't think Jose is going to regret anything about that run. He put everything he had into that run. His horse gave him everything it had. Great stop, great intensity. You'll notice how that horse really had to collect himself before rolling back. You can see the pride and the emotion in Jose's eyes right there. That's how he lives his life. And that's the way he looks now as he smiles appreciatively at his scores. A very solid score for Jose Vasquez Hernandez. 216 and a